so you just read the letter and now you're wondering how is it that I accept the Lord Jesus Christ into my life and John 3 16 is very clear for God so loved the world that he gave his only son and whoever believes in him will not perish but have eternal life and here's the key thing right is for God so loved the world he loved you he created you he made you for a purpose now the, the deal is I need to confess my sin before a holy God and make myself new. And you do that by confessing, but also repenting. Repenting means to turn away from my sin and start a new, start a new life. God again will come into your life and he'll make you new from the inside out. But again, you have to repent, continue to repent, continue to confess your sins before him for he is a holy God. And then it's a matter of, again, giving yourself to him and putting him as King of Kings and Lord of Lords into your life. Don't overcomplicate it. Confess, repent, right, and thank God for who He is. But now, live a life that matters and begin to connect with people, to begin to study the Bible, connect with people, learn how to pray, learn how to study, and do things necessary to follow after Christ. Again, there's brothers and sisters all around you who want to help you walk this walk. So don't do it alone. You were never made to do this alone. You're always made to do it with the church, with the body of Christ. Amen. Pray for me.